What's up? What's up? What's up? You already know. This is Peach, and today we are picking up my van. Y'all, my van broke unexpectedly. It was $1,289 to get it fixed, which I have right here. Okay? And for any of y'all who like, Peaches, you ain't got to show us y'all money. No, I want to show y'all this because I have been broke before. I have had car trouble while I was broke before. And a lot of times y'all get on my channel and y'all say, Peaches, you work too hard. Peaches, you just had a baby. Peaches, you need to rest. This is one of the reasons why I refuse to rest right now. I feel like I got to go hard. I got to go into heavy grind mode because you never know when things like this are going to happen. And I remember when I was in college, my grandmother was like, money not important. You don't need to work. You need to focus on school. My mama told me to quit my job. I had Section 8 then. She was like, quit your job. Focus on going to school. And I thought that was a great idea. My rent will be zero. I'll get a utility check to pay my bills. I already had a car. I could do that. Each patch. I ended up listening to my mom and my grandma. I quit my job. And I tell you about a week later, my car broke. And it was like 700 bucks to get my car fixed. I didn't have the money. My mama couldn't loan me the money. My grandma couldn't loan me the money. I didn't have a credit card where I could pay. It was just horrible. And I ended up without a car for about two and a half months until I got a student loan. And I had to take that student loan money, pay for my classes, and then take the little extra money and get my car fixed. But in that time, and as well as other parts of my life where I have been broke, unable to pay bills, unable to get a car, because I was carless for a while as well, which is why I cherish my little hoopties. Um during those times i realized it is very important to work when you are popping especially as an entrepreneur that is when you want to go hard go full speed as a youtuber i'm considered self-employed i'm a self-employed entrepreneur it is important that i save money which i do i have a savings account i have money saved i have cds shout out to the peach patch who turned me on to cds i love it i have a roth ira ri ri ah. i have a roth ira i also have a money market account so i'm okay y'all um, I know it looked like I shop a lot, but if you haven't noticed, I work harder than I shop, I promise. Um, but yeah, I'm just, huh? One year warranty, okay. I'm super happy, daddy about to make sure the car is working right. I'm super happy that we're able to be in this position. Me and my husband, we were talking about that this morning. Super duper happy. We're able to be in this position where if your car breaks, you can go into your savings account and you know take some money out and go get it fixed start you an emergency fund that's something i had started working on a while ago i already know you won't be popping forever you won't be hot forever so any of y'all who currently popping whether it's in your business on your job make sure you take it for all it's worth but i gotta go get these kids from school so peach patch um we're all in my car now and we're about to go get the little kids the reason why we rode over here in daddy's car and then now we're riding back home in my car is because Daddy's car is too small to fit the entire family. We're a family of eight. His car comfortably sits, what? It'll comfortably fit five people, six with kids, but with eight, two car seats, cause baby don't know how to sit back without his car seat. We gotta have it and plus legal reasons, but really cause he don't sit back. Um, we wanna fit comfortably. It would have been a, a hot mess. So that's why we came over here. Now we're gonna get the little kids, then we're gonna come back so daddy can get his car. I could have caught an Uber or a Lyft, However, I wanted daddy to check the car to make sure everything was right. You know how it is. When you're a woman and you go to get something fixed, sometimes they treat you a type of way versus when you're a man, baby, light green. When you're a man, um, it's like men respect men. I don't know why. I feel like when I go get my cars fixed by myself, I get got, you know? So I like for my husband to come with me. But back to what I was saying, the reason why I showed y'all the money. I work extremely hard for every single penny that I make. I'm looking at my grandma house. Ain't nobody outside. That's surprising. Um, I work extremely hard for every single penny I make. But as I previously stated, it's super important, especially as an entrepreneur, that you get it while the getting is good. While you popping, while you hot, while everybody want to deal with you, you run up your bag. But make sure you stay the bag. Don't spend it all. That's how I used to be. I used to spend it all, and I used to give it all away. Any family member called me, be like, Peaches, can you pay my light bill? Peaches, can you buy my kids some shoes? I used to do it. Now the answer is no, baby. No, baby. I ain't got it, boo. I ain't got it. I got six kids. I'm sorry, boo. I'm trying to buy this house. I'm broke, okay? I ain't, I ain't got it. Now, if it was an emergency kind of situation, I could. But most importantly, I was on um, 
Facebook and one of my Facebook friends, she did a live and she was talking about not giving people so much stuff, especially your family members that are willing and capable and keep making the same bad financial decisions. Um, she was like, you have to stop giving them stuff and you have to start telling them how to help themselves. Like, I can't get this to you, but baby, this is what you can do. You can call blah, blah, blah. This is how I got out of my situation, you know? Um, teaching, basically teaching men how to fish versus giving them the fish kind of thing. I try to put my whole family on to doing YouTube prior to one of them stealing my camera. Since then, I ain't really trying to help them. They all ready to do YouTube now. It's so funny, y'all. In the beginning, I feel so weird with my seat up behind me, but I'm sitting, leaning to the side, cutting off the neck. But, um, in the beginning, when I first started doing YouTube, nobody in my family would subscribe to me, including my own mama. Like, nobody would subscribe to me. My brother told me I suck. Y'all can go back and watch all them videos and your girl cry snot book of tears when she made it. But I still encouraged them. I still was like, we should do YouTube. We could be the biggest YouTube family in Tampa. Like, we could run up this bag. Everybody in my family know how to cook. A lot of them are really good at cleaning. They got other talents. Like, come on, let's run up this bag. And they funny. And some of them just toxic and dramatic. But um, they didn't want to do it. They didn't want to listen to me. Now that I don't really go around them and I don't really talk to them, they all been like writing me one by one. Like, hey, I, I want to do YouTube. But what you think about if I get into YouTube? I'm like, yeah, go for it. You should definitely do it. It's a lot of money to be made. It's easy. It's fun. You just being yourself on camera and getting compensated for it, which is awesome. Um, but as far as me helping you, baby, take my class. <laughs> Take my class, cause when I want to help y'all for free, y'all y'all ain't want to help. Take my class, baby. But to all of y'all watching this, I do recommend that you do a YouTube channel. It could change your life, and you could do a faceless channel. You don't gotta show your face. You don't gotta talk. It's so many different niches out there. They say it's riches in the niches. I don't. Know. It's riches in the niches, bitches. There we go. It's riches in the niches. Um, but I call it a niche. I call it niche, niche, niche. You know, whatever folks your boat. But yeah, I'm just I'm happy to be here. And then oh happy you finna catch a sleep with I'm Tampa. You know that if you're on what let me say we're on two seventy five trying to go to iPhone. Okay, if you're on two seventy five trying to merge to iPhone towards Orlando, Florida, you gonna have this long behind line. Let me let the window down so y'all can see. So what you gotta do is you gotta catch you a little sleep this sleep bay. You could have went right there, man. Oh, you got this one. And then you skip the whole line. Only native Floridians will. <laughs> yeah, do not turn on your blankets. If you turn your blankets on, everybody gonna speed up. Only native tampons. Native people from Tampa know that trick. If not, baby, you're gonna be waiting back there for 10, 15 minutes for no reason. Everybody gonna keep cutting in front of you. Now, me, what I do, because some people crazy, when I'm driving, I stop right here and I wait a couple, like, seconds, like 30, 40 seconds, because you'll always get somebody crazy. You sometimes you get them crazy people that just fly in from this side. And that's dangerous. So I wait a little bit, but daddy didn't wait. Nobody flew in, so it worked out for him. But see? Yeah, you gotta wait. Because people is crazy. Tampa, Tampa, Florida drivers are crazy. And we like to drive fast. I hate how bad traffic has gotten. It seems like everybody in their man been moving here. So the traffic is getting really, really bad. Flo? No, I said I don't know why people are Oh. Yeah, people do. They get scared. My mama's scared to come this way. She don't like to drive this way. My mama's scared of heights. Daddy low key scared of heights too, but he said he ain't scared to drive up. But he always said, if you go to Virginia, this is downtown Tampa Beach Beach. And then you come down over that Seaboard City. So Peach Patch, it is very important to make sure you're saving money. I had to learn it a hard way. I had to learn it a bunch of times. Nah, I done learned my lesson. It's like, okay, God, you can make it rain. <laughs> you can make it rain. I learned lesson. I know how to save money now. But it's super important to save. Recently, I implemented a um, monthly paycheck again. So what I'm paying myself monthly is all I'm going to spend. All my other money will be saved, okay? So I'm paying myself enough to pay my bills, buy me some stuff because I like to shop. And that's it. Everything else is getting saved, nothing extra. So another thing you could do to save money faster, Beach Patch, is to make sure you have a place for every single cent. So one of the things I do now is I move my money to its home as soon as I get it. Whether I'm moving it to a CD, 
uh, my Roth IRA, with my Roth IRA, I can contribute up to six thousand dollars annually. Um, that's the max amount. Or move into my money market account, which is unlimited, or my savings, which type of savings, making sure I put money in all the kids' savings account, etc. Me moving the money as soon as I get it, which my best friend said that's considered paying yourself. Um, it has really helped me save a lot of money. For me, CDs, which are certificates of deposit accounts, have been a lifesaver for me because I absolutely, huh. That's what I would do. Whichever one you want to do, babe. Daddy thinking about how bad traffic gonna be, so he's trying to figure out which way the best way to go to get to the kids' school quicker. But um, for me, certificates of deposits have been a huge help because I'm the kind of person if the money is in my savings account and I know I can move it out my savings account and I see some I won't, I'ma move it out my savings account. I am not disciplined enough to be like, no, that's my savings. That's my emergency fund. I really can't move it. So with CDs, even though the interest rates are low for them, I get to save faster because I know if I move this money, I am going to be penalized. They're going to take something from me. And I don't want nobody taking nothing from me. I want my little bit of interest. I ain't trying to get out none of my little money. So I do not touch the money I put in my CDs or the money I put in my kids' CDs. That has helped me so much with saving money quickly and I love it and I also love to put money in there because I feel like I'm really doing something I have transitioned from just the little regular CDs I had to ladder CDs so Peach Patch I don't want to just carry on and on about my saving method let me know if y'all want me to make a video dedicated to how I am currently saving money or some money saving tips in depth I would like to thank y'all all for watching this video your girl is so happy her car fixed I am considering getting a new vehicle, but I ain't really trying to drop that amount of money on it. My goal still is to buy our home cash. And baby, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Y'all be in the comments play hitting on me sometimes like, Peach, you ain't going to never buy no house shopping like that. You ain't going to never buy no house with your shopping addiction. But I tell you what, I got more Peaches inboxing me saying, Peach, you're going to have that house by the end of this year. Peach. I declare and decree that you're going to have your house by June 2022. I'm like, okay, Sue, thank you for the positive manifestation. But I'm constantly working and grinding towards uh, my goal. And I just, I can feel it coming. I can feel it in the air. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, you know what to do. You know what to do. Go ahead and hit a like you like. And hit a like you like. Hit a like you like. For your girl, thanks for watching. Bye. Like you like, hit a like you like. You know your girl funny, yeah, you know your girl That's dope right. If you really like me, why wouldn't you hit it, yo? L to the I-K, E-Y, babe Hit a like you like and send that love my way L to the I-K, E-Y, babe Hit a like you like and send that love my way Light, 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 light Let's go! Light, 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 light Like, 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 like Fire your girl up Fly with a like, rock with a like To the left, to the right, go like, like, like Australia better like, like, like US better like, 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 like UK hit a like, a like, a like, a like Hit a like, 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 like Hit a like, 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 like For your girl, take it back to the like Like, 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 from the left to the right Go like, 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 like Scotland better like, 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 like Hit a like, hit a like, go left to the right Go like, 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 like Like, like, I hope y'all like this sound. Thanks yeah, that's joking. right. Hit a like you like for your girl. Thanks for like, joking. Like, like, Bye. Like.